guys, this is Vampirous Studios, and welcome back. Today, we're going to be playing some more Prison Architect. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Alrighty, so in the last episode, we evicted the gang, the Green Gang. I don't exactly remember their full on uh, name. Yeah, these motherfuckers right here, the green assholes. Um, we evicted them. We evicted them from this area, and I was reading up on gangs. I watched the video that the developers of the game made, and it seems like you can actually secure areas from gangs, so that way they don't take them over, right? So, I believe for that to happen, you have to get the amount of guards in the room past this little white line, right? So, I hope, I hope this is right. We're just gonna try this out really quickly. So, let's just get a bunch of fucking guards in there. Um, we'll hire... Oh, shit, we don't have any more money. Well, fuck. We won't hire any more, guys. Let's, let's, let's see if that's enough, though. Let's see if that is enough guards to take this shit over. I really don't think it is, but... Eight? Okay, eight. Are we securing it? Okay, it's it's got a little ringy ringy shit around it. Is that gonna work? Oh, all right, so sweet. We've got it secured. So do I have to keep those guards in there to keep it secured, or can I just get rid of them? Because keeping that many guards in there is kind of yeah. Okay, so you do have to keep that many guards in there to keep an area secured. Um, I I really don't want to do that. Um, fuck. We'll we'll do it for the yard. So I believe we need, like, what, only five? So we'll do it for the yard, and oh no. It looks like our dog sniffs out a tunnel. Motherfucker! Motherfucker! Alright, so let, let's see. Let's see. Um, Where is it? Where is it? Where the fuck is it? Wrong thingy. Okay, right, right there. Um, Let's see. Five. Oh no, we're gonna need a shit ton of guards to secure that, because it's so goddamn big. Alright, well, fuck it then. Fuck it. Yeah, we'll just have two. Alright, whatever. Never mind, we're not gonna secure the areas. I thought that would actually be... What the f... <laughs> There's a bunch of dirty clothes sitting in the fucking wall over here. <laughs> That's funny. Look at that, man. Just the... It's, it's, it's like the wall of forgotten clothes. <laughs> Oh god, that's hilarious. But yeah, um, I thought I thought securing the areas would be a little bit beneficial, but yeah, apparently you have to have a ridiculous police state established for that to actually be beneficial. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and assign those areas as protection areas, and we can spiffy this place all up and whatnot, but right now we don't have any money. So we're not going to be able to do that, unfortunately. Did that guy have anything on him? No, Kristen Sen didn't have anything on him. Three days without incident. Noise, noise, noise. Alrighty, yeah, so yeah, and also the thing told me that whenever something happens to a gang leader, basically everyone in that gang gets really pissed off extremely pissed off because, you know, they they love their leader. They don't want to see him get hurt. They don't want to see him get in trouble. They sort of just want to not see him get in any sort of dealio with security, right? So that is obviously a problem. Obviously a huge problem. So yeah. And I don't think this, this like, fill capacity thing, it's not fucking working. It's not giving us the prisoners that we need. So I'm thinking we could just, like, take in, like, six a day of medsec guys. Or eight. Eight a day? I don't know. That might that might be a little bit too much. Yeah, I think we should go for six. We'll go for six prisoners a day. Maybe max security guys? Yeah, we'll get max security guys because that'll give us a, a decent amount of cash flow per day. Alrighty, coolio, coolio. Alrighty. Let's see. I want, I want our freaking guys, our engineers, our builders, to go ahead and finish this run right here. But they freaking won't. We found a club on someone there. Okay, not bad. Not bad at all. It looks like we've got a stack of roses. Ooh, look, pretty! 
Look goddamn pretty. Look really pretty. Super pretty. So what is this? Unlocked anyone who is permitted to enter. Oh yeah, we should um We should assign this area as staff only. So that way prisoners won't go up there. I just I just realized that we could do that. I <laughs> I don't know why I didn't do that before, because you know, all the prisoners, they fucking go up here. So that should keep them from going up there. Um right? Or maybe Supermax only? No, no, no. We'll just leave it on staff only. Alright, cool. Anyways, they finished up this rum here. So let's go ahead and assign it as a shop, of course. And then we need the storefront. Now this always trips me up a bit. I never really found out how exactly to do- Ooh, we got a guard tower. Maybe we should put one of these. Ooh, where can we put one of these? Um... Oh, we should have put one in here. Fuck. Inside the little... Yeah, that would have been good. That would have been really good. Alright, well, let's, let's put a tower there. There. Oh, God, those are, those are expensive. I didn't realize how expensive those were. And then we have to hire snipers for them, right? Yeah. Oh, fuck, they're expensive. Holy tits. 500 per day? Okay, maybe maybe we shouldn't get the second one installed then. And maybe that one, right? We could just move that down. Those holy balls. Yeah, we'll put that one right there. Damn, those are expensive as all hell. Why can't prisoners be assigned to a cell? I don't understand this shit. We have cells. Doesn't, it doesn't make any sense. Maybe it's minimum security? Maybe min sec doesn't have enough? Like, no, nah, let's just... I don't know. I don't know, guys. I do not know. Anyways, back to the back to the little shop, right? So we need to put in a shop front. And... Now that has to be a part of the ROM. Right? So... I don't know. We will see. We will see. Anyways, let's go ahead and set up the store. Oh boy, we should separate those out actually. Like that. And put them over here. Oh, and we ran out of money. Well, shit. But yeah, we'll, we'll be able to do it like that. Actually, we'll have to put those like that. Yeah, we'll, we'll do it like that, because that'll actually look a little bit better. But yeah, anyways, it's night time, so I'm going to go ahead and end this one off here, and come back in the morning. Alright guys, well some shit's happening over here. Some serious shit is happening over here. We've got gang members fucking shit up. Oh my lord, we got a death. Our fucking jet. Really, you had to kill- Dude, come on. The janitor, you're going to fucking kill the jet. That's bullshit. That is bullshit. Look at this, though. Look at all this fighting we've got. Oh, my God. Three deaths? Holy hell. Yeah, it's just a... Oh, my God. More deaths. More fucking deaths. Free fire. Free fire. Where the hell's our armored guard? We need our armored guard in here. Right now. Where the hell is he at? Where is that bitch at? Right there. No, wait, that's not him. Where the fuck is he at? I don't know where this bitch is at. I don't know. I don't know, guys, but I'm nervous. Because shit is going down. See, the problem is, like, the gang. It's so fucking big. Oh, and one gang. We got rid of one gang. Sweet. But yeah, look at this. 35 fucking members. It's ridiculous. Oh, my God. More deaths? You gotta be fucking kidding me. You have to be kidding me. Did the sniper kill someone? Oh, yeah, it might have been the sniper who shot shot some people. Oh, God, there's more fighting happening over here now. Holy hell, look at this. Fucking bloodbath. Jesus, man, Jesus. Yeah, it's this gang. That's what's really wreaking havoc. Did we lose an armored guard? No, we didn't. 
Damn, man. Damn. Maybe we should have eat time before... Oh, no. They really need their hygiene, though. Man. Oh, my God. They're still fighting. This guy over here. Fucking hell. James. James, is someone going to get him? Yeah, they got him. Okay. Cool. Someone stole alcohol. Or someone has alcohol on them. Damn. All right. Well, we can, we can bump up intake through the rough now. Can get rid of free fire. We could then take like 25 guys. Actually, that's a little bit too much. Um, yeah, let's just go down to 20. So they fucked up our armored guard. That's what it was. They fucked up our. They fucked up our boy. That's why I couldn't find the armored guard. Well, hell, man, hell. Jesus, more fighting going on up here? Yeah, it's the gangs. It is the gangs. See, I don't know how to root them out, though. Hmm. I don't know how to, like, get members of gangs out of their gangs. Is there, like, a program that we can set up to do that? Carpentry apprenticeship... No. Behavioral therapy. Can we start more of those? Here, well, let's start more of those. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Let's let's do more of those. And can we start another general education course? Yeah, we can. We can start quite a few, actually. All right, well... And we'll get some of those as well. Okay, well those actually cost a lot of fucking money, so let's let's get, let's get rid of some of those, and we'll eliminate one of those as well. We have a lot of parole hearings. Now, do parole hearings cost anything? No, they don't. Parole hearings cost absolutely nothing. Sweet. And they have an eighty-nine percent passing rate. That, okay, that's pretty, that's pretty fucking terrible. But then again, my parole cutoff is pretty ridiculous. Um, <laughs> for an obvious reason of me getting a lot of money when people get uh, released. But yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. People are in the yard now. Danger is going down. It's, yeah, it's really those gangs. I've got to find a way... To, oh, they fucking own this area? No, that's not gonna happen. That, oh, shit. Yeah, it's gonna be war now, huh? Oh, yeah. Of course. Free fire, free fire. Fuck them up. Fuck them up. Raise up intake, too. That's it. That's it. They need to be evicted. They need to be. Oh, and there's this one more asshole up here. Is he gonna, is he gonna attack our guard? Is he gonna try something? No, it doesn't look like he's going to try something. Yeah, that's what I like to see. That is what I like to see. Cool. Ha <laughs> ha! Bitch. Thought you were going to take over my fucking yard? You're not taking over my yard! You're not taking over shit! <laughs> These guys actually have quite a bit of money. Oh, no. They just lost money. Ha! <laughs> ha! Good job. All right, sweet. So they're going to get evicted. I like that. I like that, man. I like seeing them get evicted. Anyways, yeah, there's that. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and set up these guys' rums, right? So let's go ahead, assign every single area as a cell, and get some beds in here. Let's see, we'll put it like that. We'll give them showers right in there. Boom, 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 boom. These guys are going to have nice rooms. We'll give them the whole nine yards. And then eventually this will all be wood. We will, we will change that eventually. So it'll look like that. All right, sweet. And then bookshelves. Oops, should put it like that. Yeah, do it like that. 
boom. All right, and then what else? What else do we need? Let's see. Office desk in a chair. Okay. All right. Well, let's also put the drains in there. Let's not forget that. And then tables and desks. Um, we'll put it... Oh, this is going to be a little bit cramped. But... That's just, yeah, it's, it's going to be a little bit cramped, unfortunately. Or maybe... Oh, hang on, let's, let's, let's try it like this instead. Um, yeah, yeah, let's, let's do that, let's do that. So that'll make a lot more room for the um, office desk. Boom, boom, boom. Sweet, just like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we'll have the office desks. And those can be like that. And then we can just have the chair, like, over there. Yes! This is, yes! All right, sweet. Yeah, I like that a lot better. I really like that a lot better. Cool. Cool beans, cool beans, cool beans. All right, so they're going to have some pretty banging cells there. And we can also give them windows. Um, they are on the outside, though, so I don't really know if that's going to give them that added boost. They will be able to see outside their cells both ways, but... Yeah, I don't know. I think, I think it'll still give them the room quality that having an outside door will give you. But, yeah, yeah. I think that's pretty much how it's going to be. Oh, yeah. So, we need to fix this. We need to wall this sh Oh, we don't have any fucking money. Okay, now, a lot of our prisoners are out of shit right now. Oh, no. We need to... We need to take out a loan real quick. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take out a loan. Just so we can get those areas quickly patched up. Because that is a huge problem. An absolutely huge problem. Because that takes out quite a substantial living space out of our prison. So hopefully they'll get that installed soon. And then I put the tables in here. Instead of having shelves over here, I put the tables. And then we have shelves in the middle there. And we got a bunch of food. Now, can we assign prisoners to work in here? I I'm really not sure because I've never had... Never had prisoners, like... I've never had a shop, I should say, actually. So yeah, that, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That should work out fine. And we'll have a bunch of prisoners working in there. We don't need too many. We should also probably open up another garden. That wouldn't be a bad idea. Opening up another garden. Maybe over here, actually. Maybe we'll put in... Yeah. That's... Yeah. Let's do that. Alright, sweet. So let's go ahead and extend the stone paveway. Or actually, maybe, maybe we'll put it... Maybe we'll just make it mm, this right here. Right? So we can do that instead. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 I like that. I like that a lot better, actually. Sweet. So then we'll make, let's see, garden. And it should be that big, correct? Yes, that looks good to me. And then we'll go ahead and place in everything that we need. Cool, cool, cool. Yep, just like that. <laughs> That's it. All right, sweet. So now we can enslave more of our prisoners. Oh, yeah. Also, I found out while I was reading up on gangs, gang members do not work. Instead, during free time, they will, or instead during work time, I should say, they will actually just basically use work time as free time. So, 
we have a lot of work time. We have six hours of work time every day. So that means they're getting really six hours more than everyone else of free time. Which means they're going to be wreaking more havoc. And we really probably actually should... Oh, yeah. We really should bump up this shit. Actually. So let's get, let's get ten more guards. Let's do that. And let's deploy... Let's see. Will that be good enough to protect the area? No. Let's see. Get get two rows, so we'll have eight guys in there. That that should be enough. Six guards is enough. Okay. Actually, let's put it over. We'll put it over by one. Come on, come on, come on! Get in there, gods. I don't want them to take this shit over, because that's what's going to end up happening. So I just want my guards to secure the area before it gets taken over. So there we go. They're going to secure the area. And boom. Alright, sweet. Secure. We can get rid of one guard, right? And we'll still be fine? Yes. Alright, sweet. So they aren't getting shit out of that area. Fuck you guys. Oh, they took this shit back over? Motherfucker. Alright, so we might actually have to beef up our guard numbers then, so that way they can't possibly own this shit. We'll see. We will see. <laughs> We're just gonna completely beef it up our numbers. Because they, are, they aren't taking my shit. It's not fucking happening. That's not the way it works in this prison. Gangs don't own this shit. Gangs do not run this shit. I run this shit. No one else. I run it. Let's see. Is that good? 20. Evict them. They'd secure that shit. Alright, so. We just basically have to have guards up the wazoo. <laughs> I, I, this, this really isn't realistic, though. Um... To have guards in every single... Or this amount of guards in every single area. Just so we can secure it. I don't know. Hopefully that'll help stave off the freaking Majugalis, though. And why didn't we get intake? We should have gotten intake. Oh, we, we might have missed it. Fuck. Ah, uh, whatever. And our shop! Our shop is actually fully functioning now. What is that? Is that... Whoa! I see... Damn, look at them pixelated dead-ass! Fuck! Look at that shit! Damn! Alright, I see you, I see you. I didn't know they could buy that shit, but okay, okay. Alright, that's, that's, alright. Alright. I see you, I see you. That's all I'm saying, is I see you. And I think we are actually producing... Oh, yes! Sweet! So we are producing, um... Some Majugalis now. Some license plates. Two workers are qualified. So we'll actually end up finishing that prisoner manufacturing thingy. Mahuber then. Sweet. One interested slash qualified. Yeah, we need to really bump up the foundation education courses. Yeah, I'm going to max it out. It's going to cost us a lot of money, but I'd rather max it out and then complete this reform through education initiative and then just completely get rid of them get rid of the classes you know oh wait actually it's it's a complete waste though yeah actually that's a complete waste because we don't have enough people interested in the first place only five or yeah never mind all right get rid of those then and no one else is interested here really right 19 interested no we can start three there and, of course, everyone's interested in that. Everyone's interested in getting their drug addiction treated, so we'll add another one of those. Parole hearings, of course, yes. Plant cultivation. We'll add a more plant cultivation shits. Actually, well, that, that, that costs money. Okay, no. We'll have one. We'll just have one. Because we really don't need two. And I'm trying to save money as well, so... That'll work. 
That will work perfectly fine. And no one is interested or qualified to... Well, I think I think that really means interested and qualified. So no one's going to take the general education course. We could get rid of that. How much does it cost per class? 500 per session. So we could make a little bit of money there. No, I'm going to keep it open. Just in case someone does want to take it, then we'll have that option there. All right. Cool. Cool beans. All righty. Well, anyways, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this episode off here. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave a like, please comment, and please, please, please subscribe. It really helps out, and it really does mean a lot. So once again, thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye!